So etude number 23 here, I like to take it right in the middle of the range of tempos they give you. 64 I start off. This is all about gracefulness, and, but with a little swagger to it. It's like a villain in a Disney movie. You know they always have a little like swagger and panache to their, their movements and their clothes. You've got to have that, okay? So, so there's, there's those elements, those stylistic elements going on here. Part of that is playing these accents without a huge, ridiculous accent. Don't do this, right? Okay, going on, I do crescendo quite a lot here at the end of the first line. Because I'm setting up that, that uh, Rin Sforzando at the end of the measure on the E flat. If you're sort of only mezzo piano, it's not going to quite work, I don't think. So do a big crescendo there. Here at the double bar, I go faster. So I just think this is a more moving section of music. And I don't think it's at all weird for this time period to sort of change and alter the tempo in order to make it more expressive. So I take it definitely faster here. I let the listener know with on this rest here, on my out in breath, that I'm gonna now go at 69 beats to the minute. So, it's kind of in one here almost. Okay, and when I get back to the initial material, I just keep it at that same tempo. It's too fussy to go back to a slightly slower tempo. Okay, playing through that. I show here the major, minor. This is one of Weissenborn's favorite mechanisms. So, you know, this time here is minor, and this time here is major, going to B flat major. So I take a little time, play it a little bit more dolce, Try to make the sound lighter, etc. Show that color change. And then for this final section, this is very difficult, actually. Um, Weissenborn gives you how he wants you to play this, I believe. I haven't researched it enough, but I follow this because it's marked there and the judge will probably be looking at this. And I find it's very difficult to not over accent. Da da, da da, da da. For me, this is a, a strong, weak measure structure. So you're alternating strong measures and weak measures. Try to show that. Try to keep it moving. Try to keep the line going. Just This has got to be graceful and with tons of line, tons of lilt. One final little comment. Here, this one, the B natural up to the high G, I actually tongue it. I could not figure out a way to get that slur to come out. And here, you don't have the railroad track, so I go on immediately. Etc. This one's very difficult, very stylistic. Good luck.